think yeah, usually you get to see any of entertainment bars where you get to see any of the shows, any of the dance shows, any of the reality shows or anything. Most of the time you'll see maybe there's no such connection to a cause or anything. I think, but I call it a good karma. So, if you get to see something where you can actually show your talent, your skill and add a cause to it, it's quite a rare thing and I think it's good to be a part of it. I'm really happy in fact I'm, I'm a part of this whole uh, event in fact. And uh, yeah. Uh, what is it? What is it? Uh, see, frankly speaking, I am representing uh, Nalanda. It's a college of Indian classical dance, and we come into the classical zone. So I always believe very strongly, and our shastras also say that dance uh, or art, any art, is edutainment. This is a new word now coined, but it has been coined since ages. So if there is a cause and a nimitta for doing our art form, it's the greatest sum. Uh, uh, duty you are doing towards the society, giving them something back. And what best about this India Dance Week? We have been dancing with this uh, Sandeepji since almost three years now. And uh, every time there is a wonderful cause. So last time it was an acid victim, this time it is this, before it was PETA. So I think what we feel is we are doing something for the society and there is some wonderful contribution in our artistic way, in our creative way that we do for the society. Imagine if art is for change, art should get change in la society, people's life. And I'm, I'm proud and I'm fortunate to be part of uh, India Dance Week. Uh, I also designed logo for USA Dance Week and Dance for Cause. So I'm fortunate. Thank you, Sandeep Soparkar, to give me the opportunity to do it. So even I would like to thank him for other. And what he does is he is bringing all the dances together. It's not that there is only one dance, there is also classical, folk, western, contemporary. That's the best part of it that we all are together. It's not in our own zone that we survive. Yeah, I would like to add it in a way, actually we all people who are public figures, some people are actors, like if I've been working as a man, some people are how you've been training people and you've been a part of this associated with us in the last three years. Yes. We all have something that people look up to us. Of we course. have a responsibility towards society, yes. which we shouldn't forget. And somewhere, wherever we get a chance, an opportunity to actually be a part of this kind of, uh, uh, you know, an opportunity where you can actually uh, be a part of such association where you can uh, do your bit in between. So it, I think it's fantastic what Sadiq has done and it's been going on pretty well. I'm really happy and proud. I would be love, love to be a part of it further in the future whenever, wherever I can. I think, see, oh, I am, I've come here for this year for the first time. And um, if I look at the logo, I, I think, yeah. That's the cause. It's wonderful. I think it is ballroom. Yeah. It's representing ballroom. And uh, I like the way DNC has been put. Artistically, it looks as if they are dancing figures already. So there's a, is it true? Yeah, there's rhythm, yeah. It, so uh, it has a rhythm, a thala, cycle. <laughs> Correct? Yeah. Okay, any tips you want to give man your craft? Any tips you want to give the students? Regarding the dance? I think... Uh, any dance, any expression is wonderful, whether you follow classical, whether you follow whatever. Ultimately, it is your language, your medium, which makes you speak and express. So, whatever a person likes, a person should do with full confidence and full integrity towards it and dedication. So, every dancer should do something. I would like to say something more. Uh, this time being drug abuse, uh, this is the most, most relevant uh, uh, cause this year where the youngsters are going into all this kind of uh, negativities I would say and uh, I think creativity if children understand the youngsters understand there's so much of power in creativity nobody would go into that uh, zone this is one thing which I feel so all this is the summary of what is important in life I would say we are very much connected somewhere where I started my um, career as an actor before that I actually joined the pageant in 2005 and uh, I 
met Sandeep then as one of the person who was doing the workshop in, in the grooming uh, sessions. Uh, and I have seen that his dance, the performance, what he did at that time at Salsa, in fact, it was such a brilliant one that I was so impressed. I actually joined Salsa for that. Wow. So since then, not really directly I've been associated for those years, for initial years, but my career in being an actor or as a model started from somewhere where I was, I actually seen him there around and quite impressed or struck with the fact how he was <laughs> performing. So, yeah. And, uh, I've been following Sandeep sir for a very long time. He's been my inspiration to start uh, Latin dance forms. And I think it's a fantastic uh, opportunity for uh, people who don't have this opportunity in their town or in their region to come here in Mumbai and perform and then show their talent. Yeah, also, I would like to add that this is a place where all dance forms, you know, whether group, ho, salsa, ho, jazz, ho, what, jazz, ho, whatever you can think of, sab ek platform pe conduct ke ja plus they won the National Excellence Award last year. So I think that's quite an achievement. जो मुझे एक बहुत अच्छी बात लगी संदीप सर की वो है कि वो ये सिर्फ एक एंटरटेनमेंट के लिए नहीं है ये एक कॉज के लिए है यू नो जो मानसिक रूप से विकलांग हैं जो ड्रग एब्यूज के शिकार हैं सो आई थिंक दैट इंटेंशन रियली वर्क्स और उसके साथ एंटरटेनमेंट जुड़ा हो तो क्या बात है मैम लुक या कैमरा पहले फोटो हो जाएगा मैम इधर भी हम लोग थोड़ा राइट थोड़ा राइट में हाँ पास पास लुक इधर कैमरा आइए स्माइल स्माइल लुक इधर कैमरा आइए वन सेक Look here. Smile, smile. Look at the camera. 